Alright, so this just happened. Look, so Lord Jamar was, once again, invited to DJ Vlad's couch to spit some more venom in Eminem's direction. A healthy six days after Shady unleashed his 11th studio album, Music To Be Murdered By, the brand new BNMC sat down to voice his opinions on the two Jamar disses featured on the Royce of 5'9", Joel Ortiz, and King Crooked assisted single, I Will. While many people initially assumed the line, your group is off the chain, but you're the weakest link, was about Joe Budden, the former everyday Day struggle co-host said it was unequivocally about Jamar. Elsewhere in the song, M also spits, got a crown of thorns but it won't fit around the horns, but I'ma keep it a buck like a dollar store. I'm more than you bargained for and I'm far more worse than a 40-some bar Lord Jamar verse. Although Jamar jokes he thought stepdad was about him, he eventually gets down to business. I know what this said. I'm still unscathed. Guess what? Muff Still ain't listening to that in the hood. Nobody came to me in the hood and was like, yo, I just heard this Eminem song where he went at you. My point is proven. Nobody listens to your f So I'm chilling right now. You could talk about me a million times. The tenured hip hop artist continued, what I figured out is I live rent free inside Eminem's f***ing brain. I got squatters rights in that Okay? And might I say, filthy in there. He talks about, yeah, I be cleaning the sinks for Rakim and all this. Yeah, you know what? We clean our fucking houses, you fucking filthy piece of trailer park shit. Like, we clean our fucking houses. Cleanliness is next to godliness. Um, your trailer park is filthy and it's filthy inside your fucking brain. I'm not the guest in your fucking house. Jamar then rigorously defends the accusation he's the weakest link in Brand Nubian and says that's like calling Dr. Dre the weakest link in NWA. He concludes his tirade with, eat a bunch of puppy dicks and shut the fuck up. So yeah, what do you guys think about what Jamar had to say about Eminem? At this point, I'm sure no one's surprised, but I mean, did he have a point about Eminem always dissing him and now he basically lives in his mind? Let us know your thoughts in the comment section below. Hit that subscribe button, notification bell to stay up to date on all of our new videos. And as always, make sure to keep it all the way locked to hiphopdx.com.